minus 15. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Engines full power. And lift off Falcon 9. Go Axiom. It's one alpha. <laughs> Copy one alpha. Together we expand what is possible in low Earth orbit. Add Astra and Godspeed AX2. Plus 36, second, 36 seconds into flight. A great view of Falcon 9 heading to space. Power telemetry is nominal. A Stage great one call. throttle down. Power telemetry nominal. We're into the throttle bucket. Is the first stage is throttle down power on the Merlin engines in preparation for max Q. Falcon 9 is supersonic. Faster than the speed of sound as we're getting great views from the first stage camera looking back at Kennedy Space Center in Complex 39A. Stage one throttle up. Max Q. We're out of the throttle bucket. Stage one Bravo. Copy, one Bravo. We're at full power and that call on one Bravo, that's another one of those abort modes. As we get higher and faster, the logic for Dragon, should a contingency occur, changes from stage to stage. Impact chill is underway. Chill announcement says we're getting the turbo pump on the second stage engine cooled down in preparation for its light up coming up in just another minute from now. Again, great views looking back and you can see the contrail as we left 39A and the, uh, the shadow of the contrail against the cloud deck around Florida. Now we're coming up, three big sequences, and a view live of the crew inside Dragon. They're getting ready. We're going to get three events here, main engine cutoff, stage, stage separation, one and then we're going to light the second stage engine. We've heard the throttle down in preparation for stage separation. Eco. Two alpha. Stage separation confirmed. Copy, two alpha. And back ignition. Stage one, boost back start up. All right, stage separation. We've lit the second stage engine. The first stage is into the boost back burn, working its way back towards Cape Canaveral. Use on the left side, that's the first stage. Engine's running as we come back to the launch site, or the landing site. Second stage engine nozzle is visible on the right side as we're powering the Axiom-2 crew into low Earth orbit on the way to the International Space Station.